In today's video, the power of a PLN or personal learning network with our special guest, Diana Beabout. Hi, I'm Diana Beabout, and I've been a teacher, coach, and mentor in the United States and internationally for over 20 years. And I'm the Academy Mentor for the Coach Certificate and Mentorship Program at Aduro Learning. I am also a graduate of COTEL, Aduro Certificate of Educational Technology and Information Literacy, and currently co facilitate our online cohort. In this episode, I'm going to share four ways you can harness the power of professional learning networks. In my early years as an educator in the United States, I connected with other teachers in my building or maybe my district on different, different topics related to our content areas or things like classroom management, data and assessment, or whatever our school thought was important to improve student learning. I sometimes would connect with other teachers based on our desire to try new things in our classrooms or share tips and tricks, um, but those usually happened randomly or informally in the teacher's workroom or even in the hallway. Looking back, our opportunities to connect in authentic and meaningful ways were limited by time and location. I was first introduced to professional learning networks, or PLNs, when I joined an online cohort for COTEL. This was during my first year at an international school in China over 10 years ago. I was already on Twitter, thanks to Kim Cofino, but I wasn't quite ready to engage with people on Twitterverse. But being involved with Cotel, I started to see and experience the power of PLNs. And this was not just connecting through a social media platform. It was also the development of a PLN through our online cohorts. I was the only Cotel participant at my school, so I came to depend on and grow from the connections with other participants, them giving their input and feedback on my work. And then my PLN expanded out beyond my cohort to other educators and experts through Twitter. Through my Cotel cohort and through my growing PLN on Twitter, I began getting more ideas and access to resources. I grew more comfortable and confident with sharing my own ideas, recommending resources and problem solving with others, and was not limited by time and location. My PLN became an energizing and impactful force in my professional life. When I reflect on the power of PLNs today, the overarching characteristic of a truly meaningful professional learning network is the ability to craft it to meet our needs and goals as educators. We can develop PLNs in a variety of ways to harness their power. First, consider who we want as part of our PLN. Whether through social media media, or other digital platforms, we can build a PLN by choosing who we're going to interact with by friending or following specific individuals and groups. We connect with people in our own schools or across the world. We can find others who share our curiosity and interest in certain topics and those with expertise to share. As part of COTEL, we can connect with others who are interested in how we use technology in the classroom effectively and creatively. In my experience, our COTEL PLN engaged in meaningful ways because we were motivated to learn and grow as educators in new ways of thinking and approaches to learning. Secondly, we can decide what topics we want to learn and share about. We can follow certain hashtags or join specific groups. We can create groups ourselves, host or join a live chat. We can find out more about a topic outside education that might inspire us to be more creative and innovative. With, Co- with Cotel, I started with a focus on educational technology in the classroom in general, but through that experience, I discovered other areas of interest I wanted to explore, especially around things like digital storytelling and media literacy. And I, I expanded my PLN accordingly. Thirdly, we can decide when we want to be involved and when it's time to take a break or make a shift in what we want from our PLN. Our interactions and connections can be for short-term goals or continued interests. My PLN has evolved evolved over time as my needs and context have shifted. Over the past 10 years, as I've grown professionally and moved into different roles, there have been times when I've had to make adjustments in my PLNs and who and what are involved. Finally, there are now more options in how we develop and utilize professional learning networks. We tend to focus on using social media such as Twitter or Facebook and digital platforms such as Canva or Schoology to build PLNs. But we need to also consider how we can, be better, we can better form effective and meaningful PLNs in our local spaces, such as our school, district, or region where we might have opportunities to meet face-to-face in the same space. 
I've been fortunate to have worked in some schools where I was able to have some choice and input on where I wanted to focus my professional learning and join with other teachers in pursuing similar goals and interests. Advocating for teacher-led professional learning can result in strong PLNs that impact teaching and learning in powerful and collaborative ways. Overall, the power of the PLN comes from you. Professional learning networks benefit us when we take advantage of all the options we have in molding them for what we need and who we connect with, what topics interest us, and deciding when we need to make changes and how we decide to engage virtually and locally. How will you harness the power of a professional learning network to energize and impact the work you are doing with students? Please share your questions, comments, ideas, and resource recommendations regarding professional learning networks in the comments below or via Twitter at Adoro Learning and hashtag Coach Better. And for some opportunities to join amazing professional learning networks, networks check out Adoro Learning's The Coach Certificate and Mentorship Program, Coattail, and other professional learning options at adorolearning.com. Thanks. If you are ready to leverage the power of a personal learning network, I know you will love the Coattail program. The Certificate of Educational Technology and Information Literacy is our five course online certificate program designed by educators for educators. Coattail will not only empower you to build your own personal learning network, but it will connect you with educators around the globe doing the exact same thing and then bringing that learning straight into your classroom so that you can help empower your students to use technology for learning as well. All educators are welcome in our Coattail community, whether you're currently in the classroom, a specialist or a learning leader or a school administrator, Coattail will engage and empower you to bring new and innovative learning strategies to life in your school community. Registration for our next global cohort opens on the 18th of October and closes on the 14th of November. We facilitate only one cohort each year so we can create connected, collaborative, and community-driven global cohorts. Now is your chance to be part of the global movement to transform learning for all students. Become a co-tailor today. Head over to cotail.com to find out more. Here at Aduro Learning, we provide professional learning for educators at the intersection of technology, coaching, and leadership. Our mission is to empower the relentless learner in you to embrace your inner leader and make a bigger impact in your school setting. Join our Coach Better Facebook group and connect with us on social media for more great resources at the intersection of technology, coaching, and leadership. Thanks so much for joining us today, and we will see you next time. 